Hey, so what's going on guys? It's Tuxedo Cube here, and welcome back to Empire at War. And today we're doing the Fall of the Republic mod. So, this will be another custom battle, and without further ado, let's just get into it. Alright, so I've gone ahead and set up the battle. It is three Victory 2 class Star Destroyers, and two Venator class Star Destroyers, versus the Providence, uh, whatever it's called, the... Providence class is Dreadnought and three Munifis Mu Mun Mu Munifis Mu Mu whatever star frigates. Now we'll be doing this battle three times. First one just kind of set up like this, you know, they're looking at each other um, from across the empty region of space. The second one will be if the ships are kind of next to each other so like you know just fighting they're just like fighting point blank range i guess um and the third ones you'll see it's a little i think it's gonna go terribly but who knows it could be fun so i believe without further ado let's get the battle started commander maximum power and field okay. We need to at maximum get these guys firepower. do that. Send the Y wings in to do some fun bombing runs. Uh, everybody just standing by. Commander. Target the Providence. This thing is actually so deadly. It is amazing. Look how much damn like. I need. I'm just gonna call these um. Our engines are gone, sir. The small guys. The small guys, like, they, they're they helping out, right? But compared to the Providence, oh man. It's absolutely nothing. I really love all my fighters. This. Okay, so. So far, the Providence has almost been destroyed, although the small boys are. They're going strong. Meanwhile, one victory's gone down, the other one is almost down as well. My one Y Wing's way in the back for absolutely no reason. Okay, we are down to one victory class, but pff, that's plenty. That's plenty. We got this. We got this. Oh, we're so screwed. Actually, the Providence is about to go down, which is the main hitter. So if my Y wings could do their job, um, that would be extremely appreciated. Yeah, good, good button, right? See, I don't know why they're not. No one's coming back and stopping this. So. Our ships are being bombed, guys. Please come back. Ah, there we go. Oh, never mind. That was the wrong one. Either way, we ignore that one fighter there and the utter incompetency of ours. We are down to one more little small ship here. Munificent. Munificent. I don't know. I, I don't know if I'm saying that right. And actually, this battle went pretty well. There's still two Venators alive and kicking. I did try this battle quite a few times, and like one more ship just totally turns the tide. Like it's it's weird. Sometimes the Separatists will just do better, and sometimes the Republic won't. Well, uh, but either way, that is the first battle concluded. Ignore the fact the Venator shields are almost gone because there's one dumb fighter here. So that was battle one. Republic wins. Off to battle two. Okay, so I've gone ahead and set up the next scenario where the three victory class star destroyers are like ready to bombard the providence and the two venators are gonna dest hopefully destroy the three munificents you never know so without further ado let's get let the battle begin ready. all right gotta targeting these guys at maximum firepower i don't know where my y wings went but uh yes, sir. you know what the venators can target we'll just like Reaching target one by one hopefully just you know Take him out by one and then, uh, eh, possibly survive. <laughs> Hopefully. Alright, so the one victory is kind of already I'm lost, afraid. like, half its health, while the other two are kind of going strong. The Providence is getting pretty low. As for the Venators, they've also out. around lost half their health. But the one Munificent is very low. I'm hearing the warning bells. Oh, that's. Alright, one victory is officially down. Alright, Y Wings, do your thing. The Providence is down. Drive system is down. And the Venators still have quite a bit of health to spare. Uh, except for this one. Yikes. 
All right, we are officially one Venator down. They've destroyed our lasers. That's all right. There's still two victories with shield and one Venator with without shield. Only one Munificent left. I wonder who's gonna win. Yeah, I wonder if the Venator. Oh, Venator's going down. That's for sure. Our engines are out. So close. And the Venator has gone down. The Munificent took one with it. Well, that was a pretty quick battle, and is and was over very quickly. That was a pretty quick battle, and is and was over very quickly. Um, for anyone who wants to say that's unfair, I'll show you. Uh, the next clip will just be the results of when I added one more Munificent and two more, and the results were drastically different. Um, like it, one Munificent can really make all the difference. So. You get to see the results in probably a few seconds. Okay, so I've set up the final scenario, and yeah, I know it looks a little strange, but there's a perfectly clear and perfectly clear explanation for this. But what's going to happen is. All these ships are just going to kind of keep going in circles around the enemy, almost trapping them, right? And um, it's very similar to the second uh, scenario we did, but you never know. You never know. So I think uh, without further ado, let's see how this goes. I copy. Targeting at maximum firepower. Cruising speed. Copy. Full throttle. Let's see how they go. The ships are all on the move. The first victory is just going down. Every the find the last Venator is just being utterly destroyed by enemy fighters because apparently you need an 8v2 to do anything in this world. Providence has actually lost its shields to the credit of all these ships. Uh, the fighters are being utterly useless. I'll just send the light wings out there. I want to see if we can complete one full lap. Okay, the first victory. Half shield's gone. The one Venator actually... Oh, I thought the Venator went down for a second. Oh, another... Yeah, okay. This is going good. It's going great. Alright, the first victory has gone down. Two Venators are extremely low. Victory's, victory's chilling. What can I say? <laughs> this is so dumb. Okay. The victory is uh, around halfway done its lap. The Venator is just flying over. It just doesn't care at this point. I mean, it's just done with life. And there it goes. Ouch. Man, a lot of dead people there. Victory is going strong. Let's go. Holding fire for And it's almost destroyed the Providence as well. I don't know where that munificence going. Just buy, I guess. Bro decided to ditch the battle. Oh, it might actually get it. It's gonna get it. No way. You think this one vic the one victory might be able to clutch? There's a good chance. There's a good chance. Especially considering um, the behavior of our other two enemy ships. I I really don't understand what's happening here. It's just the, the AI just kind of like. Kill itself, or it is just some strategy I'm not seeing. Oh, that is a lot. Yeah, wow. Okay, that did damage, but it was too late. Yes, come on. It's the one, <laughs> the final munificent. Our target priority is the laser. Oh, you never. Oh, okay. It is taking damage. It is taking damage. And so is this. We're all set here, Commander. This is close. This is very close. Uh, victory is literally on its last legs, but it's so is the munificent. The munificent being destroyed like way faster. Oh no, there's its final torpedoes gone. Okay. Oh no, not. It has a heavy ion cannon battery. Okay, big word. And there it goes. We'll see. Maybe, maybe there's still hope. So the fighter victory has been destroyed, but the fighters, I believe in the fighters, if they would, they could do this. Look at that damage, look at that damage, that's what I like to see. 
The only threat? We'll these guys. Alright, the F Munificent is just running for its life at this point. Its cannons are just being wiped out. Wow, that is on fire. Can I spectate? Like, I guess this works too. Oh yeah, you can just see them bombing. And it's gone. Well, it turns out the fighters managed to actually wipe it out. And the results of this battle is... Uh, I'll let this go on. Maybe it'll finish before I'm done my speech, I guess. But it was basically a draw. Like, the... All the Republic ships got destroyed, and all the Separatist ships were destroyed too. Oh, I. This could be close. Actually, we'll. I'll see who wins this one. Okay, uh, Separatists are winning this. And I love my Arkham 70s, so shout out to my homies. Yeah, this is this is not going well. This is not. What? Oh, okay. That. Well, I guess technically in the end the Separatists won, but three fighter squadrons. I mean. All pretty weak. Well, guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, it'd mean a lot if you'd subscribe because we are four subscribers out from 150, which I think would be very, very cool. Um, if you have any other custom battle suggestions in Follow the Republic or Thrones Revenge, just put in the comments and I will gladly do it. Till then, have a good day and I'll see you next time.